My brothers and sisters in Christ, I greet you from the site of the General Conference in Fort Worth. Perhaps you've learned that we have news in that my time to be with you has been extended by four years. I recall the joy I felt in 2004 when I was assigned to the Central Pennsylvania Conference as your bishop. I have had increasing joy day by day, month by month, and year by year to have the great privilege of serving you as your bishop. You'll recall that I told you I would be with you for only four years, and so we had a great sense of urgency about all that we did. Now it looks like we have four more years, at least if that's the decision of the Jurisdictional Episcopacy Committee. I've been assured by our members of that committee, Zedna Haverstock and Lou Parks, that they will recommend that I be reassigned to the Central Pennsylvania Conference. If we have four more years together, what now can we do together? Certainly, we need to hold as the primacy of our purpose to make disciples of Jesus Christ for the transformation of the world. Here at General Conference, we've been looking at the ways that God is acting through God's people throughout this world as we've gathered with our sisters and brothers from Sierra Leone, from Bolivia, from other countries. We've seen that God is alive and active in our hearts and in our mission. And so now, let me just say to you that I can hardly wait to see what God will do in the next four years and beyond. Thanks be to God.